So I was raised in Northern Virginia uh, by a single mother, and she taught me the value of independence and education. And it was actually her who uh, got me here to Central. My father has also been a very influential person in my life. He always taught me to be a leader and not a follower. He would always say like, at the end of every conversation, I love you every day, all the way, all the time. And that's never left me to this day. Coming here in 2007, I didn't really have many family members or friends here. And the culture shock was definitely uh, an, ad an adaptation. After being a part of Central for about five years, I started working and living off campus. And um, money became an issue as far as financial aid. And so I began working a full-time job, a part-time job, and going to school, um, quickly realizing I was burnt out. And after becoming discouraged, I had ups and downs. I had lost family members. I lost money, car repossessed, different situations. And after the death of my mom last year, I didn't want to live anymore. I didn't know how to do it. She was my rock. She was my everything. She was the reason I got here. Um, and she wanted to see me graduate. And then after my father passed in April of this year, I stopped living. And just recently, I, I uh, asked myself, how do I move forward? And I remembered some words from my pastor. And he said, do the thing you were last doing when you were happy. And I remember graduation was always a goal for me and that would make me happy that would make my parents happy so after 12 years and too many tears I came back and uh, after this one class I am now graduating being a part of Bright it's been nothing but amazing I loved working in the lab and doing extra research I actually talked to the director when I first started because I felt behind since I was not uh, a, a pharmaceutical science major to begin with and I asked her if I could volunteer in the lab and I ended up staying in that lab for like four years and it was amazing. The staff here has been so encouraging and supportive. I couldn't have asked for a better major or a better department to be a part of. I currently work in clinical research and I'm enjoying that. I look forward to exploring that a little more to see um, just the different aspects and avenues of clinical research. Um, it does excite me to be a part of something so innovating and something that could benefit the world. I also look to expand the horizons in the arts. I, I dance, I sing, and I love to teach dance. I love to perform. Um, so I look forward to being a part of more performances and to teaching, especially to teaching dance to the youth. NCCU gave me a chance when I didn't believe in myself, they did, and they never gave up on me. I owe everything to my university and my support system and to anyone listening and wanting to give up, don't. You could do this.